three minutes. Taken the lead. You can turn this time. Double down. Three opponents down. Your enemy can't. Double down. Triple. Two for one. Zone B captured. You have advantage. Double down. Double down. I envy your strength, Titan. What's up guys, my name is Frostwolter, welcome to the video. In this one, we're taking a look at the new seasonal exotic linear fusion rifle known as Arvalis. Now this weapon is pretty average, it does some pretty good damage to the body so you can finish them off with a hand cannon. You can obviously one shot to the head with it so that's pretty fun. Now I know you guys have seen this all over your subscription feed so I won't spend too much time talking about it, mainly because there really isn't much to talk about to begin with. But in this loadout we're going to be pairing it up with Jack Queen King and we're going to be using a perk, a very important special perk that's going to make Arvalis more of a threat and that's inertia override. So whenever you slide over special ammo you get like a 3-4 to four second damage buff and you can one shot body shot any in the lobby so that has alone made this weapon a lot more fun for me and enjoyable anyways let's get into the live comment if you enjoy anything about this video make sure you drop a like to support me let's do it we got control on dead cliffs got some nice little engagements we can get into with this arbalist majority of these guys are going to be focused on a flag so we can get a nice little flank and try to get something going here we'll crouch because we got the you know the distance weapon here just took the lead. Got another player in front of us here at the box. Finish him off. Let's throw a grenade on there. We're gonna slide over the sand. We're trying to go for the body shot. Lost. Gonna smoke grenade. He forced me to back off here. Looks like we got a couple players coming towards B flag. Pop a barricade on this location and be safe. Gains the lead. Finish this guy off. This is amazing. Two for nice, one. we got a two piece right there. Let's keep this going. Zone A captured. He's gonna pull out a sniper rifle, and I'm gonna back off just to be smart here. Two special ammo crates here, or one. Zone B captured. Nice, we you got the little advantage. foot shot right there. Oh. We're gonna Zone patiently wait for them to challenge. We'll rotate towards B flag. And we can actually hop on C. Make sure we get some good map control. Play the OBJ. I should be up there slaying with my teammate, but that's okay. You captured zone C. You this orb of light advantage. here. Most of them are gonna be rotating towards the left. Finish them off. Let's grab down. this. Ooh, I got out Arbalest! I was about to get the shot off. We're only up by two points right now, so this is going to be a really close game if we're not careful. We want to make sure we don't let the enemy get the power ammo either, because that's also an important 
part of the game. Oh, this guy's a last word shotgunner. Okay. A special breed. I don't like this right now. We're getting a spawn flip. They're forcing us to get A. So I'm gonna try to focus on getting C flag with my teammate here. Miss a couple shots right there. Nice, okay, we finished him off. There's a spectral blades in the lobby. I'm gonna get killed. But at least we managed to trade, so it isn't too bad in that sense. We still have to worry about that C flag. Now, considering since we don't have any map control, he has a shotgun. He's gonna get me. Just completely ran through my teammate. Oh, our special blades got shut down. Not looking good. Not looking good. We're gonna pop a barricade here. We gotta get behind him. The last force, bam. Left him at one shot. Nice, teammate managed to finish that, finish that off and we're having players spawning at B. We have the C spawn. Let's hope we can get some flags back. I kind of feel like we lost a lot of map control because I ended up hopping on C the first time around and I didn't have any pressure on the map to slay out. Huge bummer. Two guys there. I'm gonna try holding down the C flag location so we can get more people spawning here. Okay, so far so good. Let's go ahead and push this left side of the map with our Arbalest. We have some special ammo in here waiting for us as well. Potential body shot. Wow, that, that's actually gonna connect to me too. But thankfully we did manage to get that trade. Don't really have too much to worry about. Just throw a grenade right there to try to slow some players down. That's the last word the shotgun map me. He's gonna get a two piece. Hopefully teammate oh left them at one HP. Okay, someone cleaned them up, thankfully. So we still have B control, which is really important. We got some players going for A flag. Don't know how I feel about that. We're gonna crouch here in hopes that someone can walk towards our lane here. You guys no shields. Pop a barricade. Multiple players. We're gonna get shotgunned again. Lots of primary gunplay going down right now. I love it. Let's just be careful with that power ammo as well. One important thing when playing games like this is you don't wanna let the enemy player slow you down. That guy's not peeking that, unfortunately. Five minutes. Managed to get one down. We're gonna get special blades more than likely. We're gonna get shock and no, all the special blades actually managed to get us. That power ammo is still there. Have to worry about that. Nice, we shut the, the down blade. Didn't get a tag on this guy. I have to worry about the B flag. Got this guy no shields, finish him off. Let's go ahead and slide over this ammo. We're gonna slide over this ammo right here. These guys are focusing on C. Ooh, teammate just shut down a Arc Strider. Zone C lost. Let's try to play for that orb of light as well. It's pretty important and also provides some support on the C flag cap here. Throw a grenade just in case he considers pushing this lane. Okay. Now we can go back towards this lane right here. And we're pulling the lead pretty well. Managed to get a two piece right there. More than likely gonna have a couple players try to challenge this lane. Finish him off. We got some special ammo we could play for. Huge risk right now. Man, I should only get one. Trying to get into cover. Unfortunately, got finished off by a bunch of nades and I only got one down right there. So the play was not worth it, I would say. I was hoping to get like a two to three piece, come out with some special ammo. Three. 
Minutes. Finish this guy off. Let's go ahead and back off a little bit. Couple players at A flag. We could try to peek with our linear fusion rifle. That guy's pretty weak. He has a shotgun. Pop a barricade here. Thankfully, our teammate helped us. Finish him off. So, we got a couple players at A. Got a decent amount of special ammo, so I'm not worried to try to waste some here. It looks like these guys are pretty much trapped in here. That's a shock. I'm gonna get shotted. We're only five points away from winning this game. We pretty much have this in the bag right now. We have some absolute map control. Spectral Blades. Anything can happen though. I'm like dying to a Spectral Blades as soon as you're three points away from winning the match. Yep. <laughs> I tried. We just need one more point. Someone sauce the Spectral Blades for the W, please. A well fought nice. There we go. Good job. GG. That's some pretty crispy plays and pretty crispy map control with the Arbalest. Overall, a pretty enjoyable match. Let's take a look how well we did, though. Not going to be a super high kill game, I assume, because we were just kind of getting some linear fusion rifle kills. Uh, we got 28. Not bad whatsoever. GG's. We did have a lot of pressure from the shotguns and the spectral blades, but ultimately, we did have a pretty good match, and I'll take that, man. 28, 2.33 KAD. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.